I'm still in shock with this foundation. Maybelline done it. Hey guys, welcome back to my channel and today I'm going to be doing a video and review on the new Maybelline foundation. I've actually heard a lot about this foundation, I've been seeing loads of videos um, about this foundation considering it is an affordable foundation. Um, that is the reason why I wanted to review it because a lot of the foundations that I have tried and used have been more expensive foundation so I wanted to do something that I can show you guys that's more affordable um, and also the videos that I've seen it is flawless coverage it's, it looks really nice on. The colour that I got was caramel beige so I haven't even opened this yet so I'm just going to go ahead and open it now. So this is the new Maybelline Superstay 24 hour full coverage foundation. And this is only £9.99. £9.99? So, I haven't tried it yet, but as I said, from what I've seen on other people, it looks beautiful and it looks like a flawless coverage. Um, I'm excited to try it properly on myself. So, um, it says it's a super stay 24 hour full coverage foundation completely corrects visible flaws and imperfections, making it the perfect base um, for a high impact makeup look. So it's an all day wear, as I said, the 24 hour full coverage. I'm just gonna go ahead and start. I'm going to also use a brush for this. I'm gonna use the Huda Beauty foundation brush. I love this brush for applying foundation, so I'm just gonna go straight in and start with the video. As you can see as well, I have actually done my eyes and my brows. Um, I'm used to doing my eyes before my face, so I've just done that so that I can show you guys a complete look at the end of the video. Um, so I'm going to go ahead and start applying the foundation. As I haven't used it before, I don't actually know how much to put on, so I'm just going to put a little bit on, and then if I need to, then I can build up. Okay, so I'm just going to go ahead and start blending this out. Okay, that like disappeared. <laughs> okay, that's literally disappeared and that's covered up all my imperfections there. I've got um, dark circles, scars on the side of my face, so that has literally covered that up so beautifully. Um, I'm just gonna keep applying this. I am loving this finish. I feel like I possibly might have a new favourite foundation. And it's £9.99. It is like... I feel like I put powder on my face. It's like such a matte... Not too matte, but it's like a, such a nice matte finish. Um, I really hope you can see what I'm saying right now because I really love the finish on this foundation. Um, I think I'm going to put a little bit more on just to see how much I can build up with this foundation. I actually can't get over this right now. I feel like I don't even have anything on. It's so light, like, even though I've just put a second layer on, it's literally so light and it feels, like, it literally feels like I have nothing on my face right now. It's giving my skin such a smooth, matte-ish finish, but it's not, it doesn't feel caked, it doesn't feel heavy, it feels so light, I literally, I'm touching my skin, it feels like this is my skin right now. It feels so nice. So as I'm repping Maybelline right now, because of this flawless foundation, I'm now going to go in with the Maybelline Conceal. This brush is my favourite br buffer brush for concealer. Um, it's the Zoeva 1, 
142 concealer buffer. I'm actually obsessed with this brush so I'm going to go ahead and blend and blend this concealer out. Now I'm just going to go in with the beauty blender and blend the rest out. I'm sorry but I really can't get over this right now. I'm loving this foundation. Okay, I'm just going to come closer so that you guys can see this. I don't even feel like contouring today. I just, I'm still in shock with this foundation. I don't even know what I'm doing. I don't know what I'm doing next. What is happening? Okay, I'm gonna set my face slightly. That's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna set my face. Also, just gonna add some contour. The reason I set in these areas as well is because I get really, really bad smile lines. So, I'm gonna leave that on while I contour my face. So, I actually can't get over this foundation. I really am genuinely in love with it. This is my new foundation. <laughs> like, it just looks so natural. Guys, I definitely am going to be doing a wear test on this foundation. Um, I don't have time to do one right now, but I will be doing a wear test on this foundation. So. As for a review on this foundation, I am really, really surprised. Maybelline done it. Considering it's £9.99 and the foundations that I usually buy are about £20-£30. No, not £20. £30. £35. So, I'm really amazed at this foundation. Compared to the ones that I've had before, I would say this is my favourite foundation now. Um, I am going to be reviewing the Norris foundation as well, so keep an eye out for that video. Um, but so far, this one, I am in love with this foundation. It, feel, it feels like this is my skin. Sometimes, like, when you have foundation on and you touch your face, it comes off on your fingers, but when I'm doing this right now, there's, like, nothing coming on my fingers. I really hope you guys have liked this video. Um, if you want to see more reviews and tutorials like this, then just let me know in the comment section. So if you can like, subscribe and comment, and I will see you for another video. Bye.